Yeah, Alicia and Allie, a lot of people are going to be waking up with broken hearts this morning. We know the seven year old child was taken to the hospital, but unfortunately he died unnecessarily after getting his hands on an unsecured gun. According to Detroit police, a pair of siblings, six and seven years old, were left in the care of their uncle. And apparently that uncle was downstairs in the basement playing video games when the children found a gun. It went off and the seven-year-old was shot in the eye. The six-year-old told the uncle, my brother is dying. Uh, we need help. It was a neighbor who took the injured child to the hospital. Detroit police telling us the uncle is not cooperating and is currently in police custody. Right now we're trying to locate a weapon. We have not been able to recover weapon at this time. So the investigation and search continues, as well as DPD's plea to all gun owners. Unfortunately, we're here again. Um, we have been at many of these scenes and the message is, if you have a weapon, put it up, lock it, keep it away from the children. Um, unfortunately, parents and caregivers are not taking heed to that message. Last year, 67 children in the city were shot. And this year, that number is well into the double digits. Wayne County Prosecutor Kim Worthy is pushing for laws that will criminally charge parents for not properly storing weapons, but it's still in the legislature. So until then, we'll continue to keep delivering that message and hopefully one person will take heed and keep weapons out of areas where children can access them easily. We've done these stories before and every time DPD and members of the community ask, when will enough be enough? But just a reminder to all you gun owners out there, there are places who give away gun safety locks for free and we'll post some resources for you on our website at WXYZ.com. In Detroit, Kiara Hay, 7 Action News. I mean, when you hear the numbers last year, 67 kids were shot and we are well on our way to getting those numbers this year. It's just terrible. Kiara, thank you.